don't worry guys, I came back with my A game today with the Lilego T-Deck Plus. <clears throat> now, let's see, this is a Lilego device, <clears throat> I love this, so there should be no reason why I don't love the T-Deck Plus. Now, one thing before I got this is, there was a T-Deck Pro, but it was like paper ink, <clears throat> I want that. When they upgraded the T-Deck Plus, like the day I bought it, I didn't even know, so the old one had like a bad, uh, not bad, bad keyboard. Not bad, bad. Bad keyboard that was like rectangles and all the buttons were next to each other. But this one is supposed to be more like an actual spacing on the computer. Now, I have already opened this up. And this is what it looks like. Now, okay, hear me out. It does not come looking like this. These two antennas on the top I added myself. This is GPS. This is the radio one. And yes, I added these myself. I made a video, but... Guys, it's hard when you're doing stuff up close, attaching little things. So, I mean, I'll check the footage, see how it turned out. There's no way I'm opening this thing back up again, though. <sighs> Guys, trust this one. So, it's got this cool little carrying case. Just plastic, though. So, when you turn this on, it comes with the beta firmware. And I downloaded Meshtastic on here. Which, basically, I just want to talk about what this device is. You're like, oh, another mini computer? Well, first off, if it was a mini computer, that'd be awesome because it's so tiny basically with mesh tastic you're able to send now this is what i keep telling you guys they are scamming you cellular service scam wi-fi scam you do not need to pay to light pixels up on a screen and this just proves that so to send texts all that stuff scam i keep telling you guys you're like what the heck you're able to send messages to other devices like this no Wi-Fi, nothing. Completely off the grid, encrypted. No one will know where, where they're coming from, what they say. And it's just a beautiful device. So I wanted to get some. So I got Mishtastic on here. It's got this mouse pad. But I want to take it a step further. And today I want to show you how to get Launcher, Mishtastic, and Bruce from around here. Now, I've never done this before, but... I mean, like, every single thing I show you on here I've never done before. And it normally turns out well. Ooh, and I also got this NRF24 board. So I want to check this out with Flipper Zero tomorrow. But in the meantime, let's get on the computer and upgrade this device. This is Editor Ilya. And something I realized, I'm about to show two methods. If you want to see the second one, which is just the Mesh Tastic, no Bruce, skip to here. But the first method, I say it doesn't work, only Bruce works, Mesh Tastic didn't work. I stuck on the loading screen, but I guess it takes a few minutes to boot up for the first time. So I guess the first method does work. You want Launcher, Bruce, and Mesh Test all together. Okay, so what we're going to do is grab an SD card. Thankfully, I have some for once. Ordered these guys just because I swear I never have any SD cards. I don't know how it happens. So they all just disappear from me. To all these devices. But anyway, here's our SD card. And we have a slot right there, I believe. I didn't need to go all the way in. Tweezers. Okay. Let's see. Okay. And that looks pretty much in. So, wait. We're actually going to have to take it out in a sec. Okay, whatever. But we want to go over here. We want to go to Launcher. Wow. There we go. Why does my computer not remember this? Let me move my screen recorder. GitHub. Broccoli. Go to launcher. Now, I mean, here's all of our launchers that we could download. So you could do that manually. Boring. Or you could come over here to the actual launcher. Here's the web flasher. You could just go to latest because who wants beta? T deck. Now, keep the trackpad button pressed. Press RST. I don't know what that... RST, what? Beats me. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug this side into my computer. We need to put this in boot mode first. So it can actually... Boot lander mode? Is that what it's called? Now, let's see. T deck normal and plus. Now we can hit connect. We're going to want to hold down this mouse button in the middle. While plugging it in. Shoot, 
boom, connect. It will say connecting, install, erase, next, install. And boom, now it's erasing the Metastic firmware previously had on here. I mean, look how shiny the screen is. You can even see my lights so perfectly. Yo, look, it's me. But, oh wow, so this is going fast. It's already at 58%. Now, once it's downloaded, we could do a few things. So, let's see. Well, that's doing that. Come over here. Well, actually, one sec. I actually already have it open. So, installation complete. Let's see. Yo, launcher. Now we could take out this SD card. Now, there are two ways to do this. We could do it via online, but this is the original way. This is how I know how to do it. But if this does not work, we could go to the new way and use the actual online thing. But we could grab this SD card, plug it in. As so. We'll hear that sound. Then we could go over here, and I already have this open. And we want to go to Meshtastic Firmware by, I don't see who it's by, but just over here. And we could scroll down. And we're going to want, where is it? Which one is it? The C3? It's the C3, right? Wait, it's S3. Is it this one? Let me check. Okay, so we're going to want to download this one, the E3, wow, ESP32, S3, 2, 6, 11, 60, EC5, you get the point. Now that this is downloaded, <clears throat> well, I guess while that's downloading, we could go, okay, yeah, here, so we could open the file, and I mean, phew, here's all the devices, so I mean, let's open this up, actually, I need it a little closed. So we could close this from over here. Let's see this a little better. Now we're looking for a T deck. Tell me if you see it. Mm. Okay, now I'm seeing three, four T decks. Let's see. I mean. We've got four right here, so I'm going to take all four of these. I'm just going to bring them over here for now. <clears throat> so I'm going to bring them over here for now. Let's just drag these to downloads. The copy. I don't know which one of these it is. We'll figure that out later. But now that we got that, we can open up our browser again. We're just going to want to go to... GitHub, not the launcher, let's see, so by P-R-E-Y, I keep saying E, I swear I did that last time, P-R-3-Y, now let's see, we're going to want to scroll down to Bruce, oh, there's 44 more, Bruce Lily Go, where is it? Hmm. T Deck Pro. So not that one. Just the T Deck. Because the T Deck Pro is the E Ink. And now we have this here. And we should have all of our files downloaded. So now we could grab these. Let's see. USB drive. Let's see what's in what's here in config. Okay, well in the meantime, we could just drag. Oh, wow, not all of those. All of these over here. Oh my goodness gracious, guys. Why is my computer not listening to me? To USB drive. And, I mean, they're all in here now, so let's eject and see if this method worked. I mean, if not, I might not put this in the video, but it's good to know for you guys, even if it... And let's see. Let's power this baby on. Launcher SD. Okay, let's see. Install. Guys, that might have happened already so fast. Wow, I did not think that would work. I can see the firmware is kind of glitchy because the bar is up on the top and supposed to be down here. 
I mean, I did hit the advanced one, not the beta, so. Because I'm not a beta, so. Let's see, let's turn this around. Hey, mesh testic. Hmm. Okay, so that is a different mesh testic, I'll say that. Where's the one I wanted? I'm going to go through all these real quick. Okay, so I did get Bruce on here, but that is about it. Now, you know, why is that it? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. The Mesh Tastic was taking me to way older version. So, <coughs> I hope you said bless you. And, I mean, they all worked. It was just not what it's supposed to. And I heard Bruce isn't that good on here, actually. So, I think I may just have to go with Mesh Tastic. Okay, so, let's do this one last time. My name is Miles Mer Okay. No, okay, so we want to go to Mesh Tastic Web Flash. Like before, we want to hold this. Mesh Tastic Web Flasher. This is super easy. Come down here, choose this. Boom, boom. Oh, I don't want to be a beta. I want to be this one. Flash, blah, blah, blah. Sure, I totally agree. Mm hmm mm hmm Yep, I've done all my information on it. This one, pretty sure. I hope I'm not flashing my computer with mesh testing. Let's see, it says it's running. So, I mean, after we get that done, where was it earlier? We want to go to a specific website to get this actually set up. <laughs> mesh Tastic Web? Oh, yeah. Okay, so we want to go to Mesh Tastic Web. Not the web flasher when we're done with this. So I'm going to let this go through its thing real quick. And then show you guys what happens next. So we actually want to unplug it now. Plug it back in. Don't want to hold any buttons down. And now we should just be on our Mesh-tastic firmware. New device. And boom. Now that we see this here, we have Mesh-tastic popping up on here go to config and we want to go to Laura US and save and boom that's actually it boom now it says rebooting with my new region and name and that is how we get firmer on the T deck plus now I do want to do way more videos in the future with this I have a good antenna coming tomorrow I have a GPS antenna right now, but I think I just need to spend some time figuring this device out, how it works. And then we should be doing a lot more content in the future with it. I want to find, <clears throat> hopefully there's some people here, boring, so probably not, but I am going to Washington. And I feel like that is a place where a lot of people would have mesh-tastic devices. But that is it for this video. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. This device is actually just awesome. Oh. Oh, it's rebooting now. Oh, there we go. Actually, just an awesome, beautiful piece of tech. That is it for this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.